Patches is situated in, in the main quad. It's one of three houses in quad, just a stone's throw from the dining hall and library and chapel. One of the great things about Patches is the boys always say that they don't have to go outside to get to the dining hall, so they literally roll out of bed and they're there for breakfast, um, which is quite nice. Um, we've got a lovely front lawn as well, where particularly during the summer term, the boys will play a lot of touch rugby and they'll be out hanging out and just socialising and socialising with other um, houses as well. So one of the things I've been really impressed with is the ability to to just sort of uh, push themselves out of their comfort zone, try new things. One of the big things for me was, I think Patchell's, um, when I first took over, was was very much the, the sporty house. Um, we still have a strong um, sport ethos in the house, but I think what's great is we're now starting to see more people's involved in drama, music, we have a lot of boys in the choir. So I think that diversity is really, really important. It's important for me as a housemaster to ensure that uh, every pupil thrives in their area. We've got two main common rooms in the boarding house. We have a common room which uh, where we hold the majority of our roll calls, any sort of social events, those sorts of things. We also have a junior prep room, which is used for the third and fourth form boys, um, and it's monitored by one of our lower sixth pupils uh, during the evenings along with the tutor. Uh, upstairs in the cubes where the juniors are, they also have a, a snug area where they hang out as well. And then we have three brew rooms, little kitchens that are used um, for each of the sections of the house, so junior, middle and, and upper sections of the house. One of the USPs for Patchels is the cubes. The boys in the junior year start off there. It's a fantastic experience, slightly different to other dorms. Um, it's very, very traditional boarding. So they're part of a big corridor with maybe 16 to 18 boys, but they've got their own individual space, which is great. We have nice wide corridors, so there's room for socialising. There's a snug area on, on that corridor as well. Senior boys always look back very fondly on their time in the cubes, and they, they do say that, that that was their best experience. They really, really enjoyed it. I think the benefit of being in a vertical house is you see the, the pupils grow and you build really, really strong relationships with them. Um, so I'm in the end of my fifth year now, um, and this is my first cohort that have come right through from the, from the third form. So seeing them from day one um, and how they've, they've now turned into young men going off to university um, or gap years, um, I think that's something that's very special. And that's, that's the great thing about a vertical boarding system that we run here at Glenamond.